Tabula rasa, blank slate, a blank red slate, and anything was possible. Anything could happen with Duna there below them. Months of hard work, test flights, failures, and construction went into building the behemoth, and now its crew was in their last moment of anticipation, an anticipation that had lain in each of their hearts since childhood, and now suddenly it bloomed below them like a child's crayon drawing of the red planet. Finally, after all of their work, in these last days on approach, they were perfectly free. Free of the past, free of their future. Weightless in their own warm air-like spirits. But they might never be so happy again. Beauty was the promise of happiness, not happiness itself, and the anticipated world was often more rich than anything real. But this time who could say? This time might be the golden one at last. Come what may, they had earned their chance to try. They had reached Duna. There were craters everywhere on the surface. The short, rugged, curved mountain ranges were darker than the surrounding countryside, a rust color broken by black shadows. But both the light and dark colors were just a shade away from the omnipresent rusty orangish red, which was the color of every peak, crater, canyon, dune, and even the curved slice of the dust-filled atmosphere. It was transfixing, mesmerizing, and everyone on the behemoth felt it.